Well, good morning, Peter, and welcome to Swansea University. Well, it's good to be back. Ah, yes, it, it's very nice to have you back. Um, it's been quite a couple of weeks, I think. I wonder if you could tell us a little bit about how these exciting events uh, unrolled for you. Well, it started, I suppose, when I went to the Eritrea Summer School uh, on the 25th of June. And before that, I'd been talking to people in the UK who work on, uh, on Atlas and CMS, uh, and they'd agreed that the, the, it was very unlikely that <coughs> CERN would get as far as a five standard deviation announcement mm. in time for the Melbourne conference. <coughs> so I went off to Sicily uh, with no Swiss francs and a travel insurance policy which expired on July the 2nd, the day I was due to fly back from Sicily to, to, to the UK. And during the week, um, the rumours began to build up and a call came to my colleague Alan Walker from John Ellis, who said, if, if, tell Peter that if he doesn't come to CERN on Wednesday, he will very probably regret it. So I said, OK, I'll go to Geneva. And that was, uh, that was the beginning of, of uh, a few rather exciting days. I understand you went for, for dinner with John Ellis on, on the Tuesday night. Yes, the, the, um, the message from, from John on the Saturday <coughs> invited us to come to dinner with him on the Tuesday evening before the seminar and that's that's the way it happened so the next significant event was when we arrived at John Ellis's house for dinner and he opened a bottle of champagne <laughs> I see so you, you, you sensed something was up yeah. what what can you remember I mean we all watched those uh, amazing scenes in the main lecture theatre uh, at CERN mm -hmm. on Wednesday. What, what can you remember from that? Well, I can, I can remember the, the uh, excitement building up as the um, two speakers announced their results. Uh, and um, uh, when, it, when, it, when it was all, all over and, uh, and they both announced that they're, they're very, really rather amazing uh, results, um, they got a standing o ovation, and people started cheering and stamping, and it was more like the end of a football match <laughs> with, when the home team had right. won than as the usual scientific meeting. We've, we've discussed that uh, there's a very memorable image of you, a photograph taken of you with, with Fabiola Giannotti, who was the, the leader of one of the experiments. Um, and it seemed to me to enc encapsulate the, this relation, this bridge between theory and experiment, seeing the two of you there. Um, what do you think now of the, the experimental effort that, that's gone into? Well, I think it's really, tr really tr tremendous. I mean, it's, it's quite amazing the way it has worked, but it's, I mean, it's, it's thanks to, w well, several things. I, I mean, the success of the machine itself, built built uh, under the direction of Lynn Evans. It's the, the result of, of the, you know, the, 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 uh, these amazing detectors w which uh, are, are built from components which come from all over the world and, and, and which amazingly fit together properly <laughs> and, and, and produce really excellent results. There's, a lot of people involved in each each co collaboration, working working hard to get the results out, and um, probably last not but not least, there's the grid computing mm. network, which uh, I, I think has been the, w one of the things which has enabled them to to do it this quick quickly, and um, that that seems to have worked extremely well so it's a, it's it's a result of a number of different fa factors but it's, it's still amazing that it's happened and what is it like to have your what does it feel like to have your theory vindicated after after 48 years what was well as I, I think I've said several times before it to that question it's 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 nice to be right about something sometimes <laughs> uh, 
uh, and it's obviously a, <coughs> a long wait. <coughs> but at the beginning, uh, um, I had no expectation that it could happen in my lifetime because mm. so little was known about what, what the mass of this particle might be. Did you know at the time that you'd done something special by writing down this model and identifying this effect? Well, this I, 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 I did, but uh, I didn't. I mean, I didn't know quite what the impact was going to be. I, I just uh, uh, felt that um, you know that this was the best, the best thing I'd ever, ever actually done mm -hmm. in theoretical physics, and uh, and I was. Very, very annoyed when the first, first ver version of my second short paper was rejected. Last week, I think, we saw a watershed in physics, we saw the, 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 the boson being discovered. Um, what do you think will happen next in the, in the, the weeks, the months and years to come? Well, what happened last, uh, uh, last week was really uh, the, the end of a chapter. It it, um, it was the last last bit of the standard model, and it's, well, that's you know it's satisfying that that's happened. But that's really not the most interesting thing uh, that the LHC is is uh, looking for. Um, I mean now now that that seems to be more or less settled. There's, I mean, there's still, still, actually, a quite, a, quite a lot of detail of what this, this uh, particle is. Is it just a single standard model Higgs boson, or, or is it one of a, of a bigger multiplet, mm. such as occurs in supersymmetry? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, <coughs> th that's the next interesting question, and it's, the, the, I think that's uh, the kind of thing the sort of measurement of the details of the, this particle is the, the, the beginning of the uh, en entry to what lies beyond the standard model at LHC. Mm -hmm. It's not the only um, the only kind of experiment which goes beyond the standard model because already we have uh, interesting properties of neutrinos which aren't in the standard model but but as far as LHC physics is concerned, this, this I think, op opens the way to what may come next. I, I would go along with that. I mean, for, so, for somebody of, of, of my vintage, this, this is the first really big thing that's happened. When I, I joined the field shortly after the discovery of the W and the Z bosons, and uh, essentially not much has, seems to have happened since then, except that, that we've been confirming the standard model more yeah, and more yes. precision. Now suddenly there's the prospect of something new uh, cropping up and that makes it very exciting. Yes, well I think uh, I think one has to say watch this space. <laughs> the LHC ha has a lot more, t more to do yeah. and it, 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 it promises to be much more interesting than, uh, than what's just yeah, happened. Yeah. Finally, we're only a, a few days into this, uh, this, this great watershed event. How do you think your your own life will change as a result of, of this discovery? Well, that's that, that that's of course speculation. I mean, I, I can only uh, tell you the obvi obvi obvious thing that uh, that uh, in the last few da days my my own life has has uh, changed a, a bit as a result of of media attention, but that's not all that new because. Uh, Every time the LHC people reported a hint of, of the Higgs boson, even uh, the, the press uh, descended on me and, uh, and asked me for comments. And I, I got to the point, certainly after the December announcement mm -hmm. from, from Geneva, that, that I, I said, I'm, not, I, I'm going to adopt CERN's own criteria. I'm not going to comment on, 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 on this until it's a five standard deviation result. You certainly did a very good job on my answer phone of convincing me there wouldn't be any uh, <laughs> any announcement. That was just a couple of weeks ago. Well, I yes. I mean, at the time, uh, that's what I thought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Peter, it's, it's been a, a pleasure uh, to talk to you and, and have, these, have these insights. Uh, and I wish you 
every success uh, for the future. Thank you very much for, for taking Thank the you time. Thank you very much.